Hello, in this video we're going to look at uh, cameras in Unity and how to add cameras to your project and how to um, edit those cameras. So I've got a basic um, scene here. I've got a terrain that I've set up with lots of trees and uh, hills or mountains. And basically I'm going to add some cameras to see different views of this world. So with cameras you can assign cameras to different players. Um, your characters in your game so for example you could have like a first person um, camera view that follows a character around if you're you know playing in first person mode and you can have um, set up different cameras for um, you know different animations and things so when you start a new project you'll probably see that there's usually there's usually a main camera already set up there and when you click on that camera in the hierarchy or give you a preview down here and when you click on play to go into game mode, you'll see that you'll see the game from that actual main camera view, which in this case is not a very good view because it's right at the edge of the terrain. So um, what I usually do is just delete the camera. So you can just, um, just delete, delete that main camera. And now you can create your own cameras as well. So if you go up to game object and 3D object, Oh, sorry, game object and then camera. You can create a new camera and you can give it a name if you like up here. Um, and you can also um, move it around and rotate it just like you can any other object, um, any other 3D object in Unity. So if I click on that camera in the hierarchy to select it, we'll see that the camera is actually here in our scene and um, these this rectangle here actually represents the view that this camera can see. So the camera is set up here and it's looking um, in that direction of the blue arrow there. So it's actually looking that way. All right. So if we zoom in, oops, that is pretty much the view there from that camera. So the camera is actually underneath the terrain. So you can see in the camera preview there, it's actually looking from underneath the terrain. So you can move it just like any other object. We can grab this um, Y, the, the Y handle there, and we can move it up so now it's above the terrain. You can see in the camera preview, that's what it's going to look like. All right, we can move it across as well. And we can also um, we can just rotate around here. We can also move it on this blue handle here, on the Z handle to move it backwards and forwards. So it's just like moving any other object. You can also change the values in here. So you can change the position values for the X, Y, and Z axes um, right there in the inspector panel. All right, we can rotate in the same way. So I can grab this green handle here to rotate the camera around, or the red one to make it look up or down, and the blue one to sort of tilt the angle. So you can see there in the camera preview that it it changes as I move it around. All right, might just uh, reset that back to where it was, undo. All right, if we go to play, yeah, we see a bigger preview there of the game from that camera angle. All right, now we could add another camera again. We can go up to game object and then camera. So I've got camera one here now, and we could do another one, we've got camera two. So we've got camera, camera one, and camera two. Camera one, we might just want to um, move that around a bit and move it up. So spin it around, move it up. All right, and then camera two, we might move that one all the way over here. Move it up again so it's not underneath the terrain. Um, maybe move it down a bit again. And we might just actually point it down and move it that way okay all right so now we click when we click on each of these cameras we can see in this little preview box here we can see each view so we might have different um, players later on that we set up in the game and for each player we can also attach a camera to that player that moves around with them but um, in, at the moment, these are just cameras that are set up. They're not actually assigned to any players or anything like that. They're just cameras that are set up in different locations with different views. But cameras are very handy in Unity. So with different cameras, 
you can completely change the, the view of the world. So for example, one, uh, one viewer might have a camera attached to them, which might, um, from their view, they might see sunny skies, a few clouds around, and another player might be in a different location on the map and they might see um, you know, very cloudy skies, okay? And somebody else might see sunset. So you can have different um, views or different sky boxes, which we'll look at in the next tutorial um, for each player. And you can use different cameras for each player. Um, you can set up like different views, like a first person view um, as an example. All right, so that's how to add and manipulate cameras in Unity. Thanks for watching.